Let's get the weather now with Dan. Thank you, Susie. Well, we're going to have to get familiar, I think, with rather cloudy skies uh, for the next few days. High pressure is, in essence, dominating the story. It's centred to the south of us, keeping these uh, weather fronts away for the time being. They will eventually come in as we go through the course of uh, Thursday. But high pressure is characterised by dry air that's sinking through the atmosphere. And because it's sinking down to the ground, it's exerting pressure on the Earth's surface, hence why the pressure is high. Now, as that dry air sinks, it warms up, it expands. But down at ground level, we get this area of cool moist air that gets trapped where we are and you get this sort of boundary between the two an invisible boundary called an inversion and it means there's a sort of big difference really in different types of air either side of that now at this time of the year when you've got a very weak sun long nights and light winds this cool moist air under clear skies develops mist fog and eventually low cloud and that is really stubborn to clear at this time of the year it also proves quite tricky forecast wise to know exactly when that will clear because there's no wind really to mix it up mix it up into that dry air and clear it now at this time of the year as well when you've got an inversion it can also affect your TV uh, and radio signal not all the time but sometimes if the conditions are right your TV signal can bounce off of that inversion and so you may find as you're driving in the car and you've got the radio on you might start to get some interference from a Spanish radio station for example uh, over the next few days not promising that will happen but it might do so for today you can see the sunshine around also areas of cloud floating in from the uh, northwest still some good spells of sunshine uh, this afternoon and so clear spells around uh, first thing this evening but uh, a lovely picture here from Norfolk from one of our weather watchers. The contrails in the sky first thing this morning and uh, further west across Cambridgeshire. Still some good spells of sunshine to be had through the course of today. So clear spells around first thing this evening. Some mist and fog forming and chilly, two or three degrees for a time. But cloud will increase from the west as we go through the night and that will lift the fog up. It will also lift the temperatures up. So by the morning we'll be back up to about five or six degrees. No scraping of the car windscreen tomorrow. And a pretty cloudy day expected uh, for Wednesday as well. Perhaps the odd spot of rain but uh, much of the day will be dry tomorrow again a lot of cloud right the way through and maybe one or two brighter spells come the afternoon top temperatures tomorrow 9 10 maybe even 11 degrees 52 in Fahrenheit so a different feel to things I think as we go through tomorrow the cloud thickening again tomorrow night and here comes that weather front bringing some outbreaks of rain uh, into Thursday light patchy rain but a very mild night temperatures not dropping any lower than about eight or nine degrees as we go through Wednesday night into Thursday morning so gone are the frost for the time being a bit of a cloudy damp day on Thursday some patchy rain no great amounts drying up a little bit later on looking mild then for Friday and Saturday again a lot of cloud breeze picking up through the weekend might mean a return to some sunshine as we get towards Christmas Eve Susie thanks Dan I hope there's no interference during look east <laughs> let's leave you now with a fabulous choir called the Novem Consort nine students from South End High School for girls this was recorded at Holy Trinity Church in South End good night <laughs>